wrestling has more than one royal family. Trish, so nice to see you. Congratulations on winning your championship. Have a seat. Thank you, Rob. It means a lot to me. Yeah. And I'm grateful that you're having me represent you at your company as top champion. Nah, don't mention it. I mean, I did help him becoming an elite wrestler in this field, but you deserve that win, that's it. Now that I am champion, I'm curious, what do you have planned for me next? Well, since you won your championship, I want to have you booked and scheduled for a much more challenging opponent. And this opponent does not like you very much. Wait, this person doesn't like me very much? Who is it? I didn't think I'd have very much enemies. Well, she might not. Well, you might not remember her, but uh, she's quite familiar with your independent wrestling days and uh, she wants her payback. Which indie wrestling company is this? Bottom line for me. Well, the one is from uh, JCW and she's one of your most heated rivalries. She goes by the name of Patricia Escobar. Are you kidding me? You keep that person's name out of your goddamn mouth. You've got to be joking. This match is going to be good for you. All I want you to do is win and bag her. This match is going to be a no holds, bare falls, counts anywhere match. So you want me to bury her and you want me to put me over by winning? I'm fine with that, but I want this to be unscripted and unpredetermined. I want this to be a real fight. Okay, you want this to be a blood sport. Okay, it's your funeral, but in the end of the day, you have my support and I want you to win. Good. Because remember, you have an authentic wrestling champ here, but you bringing in a newcomer like this clown to face me at the next pay-per-view match is absolutely ludicrous. It's like you're having her take shortcuts in this industry. I understand that. She's going to be facing others before she'll face you at the Slammiversary. I mean, I'm certainly not going to let her take the easy way. Great. All right. That's all I wanted to hear. Oh, and don't forget. I chose this match because I want to mold you into a superstar. I want this match to be a spectacular five-star match. So am I the good guy or the bad guy? You're gonna be the heel. Now go. That's perfect. But remember, I'm always the baby face because it's worked with my wrestling gimmick and I can't wait to bash your head in with this steel chair. Goodbye, Rob.